Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday. Yes. It is Wednesday. It is Wednesday, my dudes, and it's not even morning. It's yeah. afternoon. It's uh, well, afternoon, morning. Same difference to me. I mean, I'm an insomniac, so it is what it is. But uh, we're up in Stratford here. We are going to be staining a pergola. Let me flip you around, show you what we got so far, and then we'll get to spraying. This is what we're going to be spraying. Um, it had latex-based stain on it before, but since there's no heavy foot traffic, since it's above and all that, it, it lasted quite a while. But we uh, did a chemical clean on it, and uh, now we're getting ready to spray it with a solid acrylic. We taped up the entire area here, as you can see, over all the stamped concrete, since uh, we definitely do not want to get any overspray on it. We got this all taped up. Side of the house taped up. Jeremy's getting ready to go up there. Took the uh, gutter off on this side. Because you could see when they did it last, uh, they didn't get that spot. But we're going to get that spot this time. And uh, here's what we got going on. We actually had to uh, get a custom mix on this one. Uh, the original color was from the Pittsburgh paint line and we needed it in the cabinet line. So what they did was took the Pittsburgh color code and mixed it into a cabinet. Uh, so it was a little tricky, but we got five gallons of it. And this is going to be, the color is russet, which is a Pittsburgh color. So yeah, let me uh, uh, get Jeremy a hammer here quick, and then uh, we'll probably start spraying real soon, and I'll get you some spraying action in. So we'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, we are uh, up top now, and uh, I'm spraying the top, and then when I'm done with the top, Jeremy's gonna get the bottom. Oh, the bottom side. So uh, let me uh, flip you around, show you uh, what we got. Uh, I'm probably right around the halfway mark, a little over halfway. Uh, I got about three quarters of it. I got most of the sides. Uh, just when Jeremy goes down on the bottom, he should only have to spray one side, which is this uh, inner side here. But I got all the way around uh, most of them. So here's uh, what we got left from there to right there. So... I'm going to keep plugging away at this and uh, stay tuned. All right, guys, I got the top side done. Uh, Jeremy is working on the bottom side right now. Let me flip you around and uh, show you progress. So this back side, Jeremy has to get this back side and uh, the back of these. I got the other side of them. how it's coming out it's looking amazing like I said it's, it was a lot of time tarping everything here but uh, yeah I guess I really didn't need this this one right here but it was an extra precaution because uh, well stain came right down to here so There's one plant that got a little uh, sprayed, but, well, two, but they'll live. All the other ones have been tarped. Well, that one got a little bit on her, but it ain't bad. They'll live. Turn out real nice. We should be done here about an hour, um, and that'll be it. And then uh, tomorrow we're gonna start replacing boards on the Nielsville deck project that we got going on. So 
I'll uh, show you guys the finished product when we're all done, so stay tuned again. All right, guys, we are fully finished. Took all the tarps down, put the gutter back up, uh, did our cleanup. So let me flip you around and uh, show you. Turned out real nice. And with any deck or staining service that we use, uh, we also offer our three year warranty on them. So any touch ups for three years, it's, it's free. The labor's free. Um, it's just the product that you'd have to buy if you run out of it. But uh, they have about a little over a gallon in that five gallon jug. So that'll be enough for them to do the deck and have any extra for touch ups. They'll probably have half a gallon for touch ups. And uh, for those, we use a brush. Because usually they're, they're pretty small areas that uh, eventually flake off. But uh, yeah, here's how it turned out. Didn't get anything on the concrete, so it uh, turned out real nice. So, all right, guys, I'll uh, see you in a bit. So that's it for this video, but we will be uploading another one very soon. Tomorrow we're... I already did the uh, pressure wash and chemical clean on a deck, so tomorrow we are tearing up the bad boards. We found about 10 of them. Um, the previous uh, application was latex based stain, and it ended up ruining the boards. So we have about 10 boards we have to replace on the deck tomorrow, and then uh, we'll be doing another spray job on it. So stay tuned, and thanks for watching. <laughs>